I ordered Team Harpy to intercept the package and make the Nazi bastards miserable along the way. They needed no encouragement. What none of us knew was that a storm was on the horizon. With Nebula, the Nazis had unwittingly shaken something awake. Something far more powerful and fearsome than anything we could ever hope to comprehend. Yo, yo, yo. Alright, we're live. We're back. I always liked the intros and the cinematics since Vanguard was released. They have all been entertaining and lit. Very fire. Very fire. So that was the cinematic for season three. And I haven't done one of these. Uh especially youtube video Ooh, for a while um because there hasn't really been any seasons that's got me excited except until now so we're gonna look through the battle pass and see if it is worth it we're gonna see if it's worth it and whether or not i should purchase it live here and now um i think the first season was kind of just a must-have just because it was the first season of caldera right but in hindsight it wasn't all that the second season was really underwhelming as well but the way this season three has been advertised and from some of the things that I've seen from it, this looks like the meat on the bone. So we're going to check it out. We are going to check it out. Um, let me just clear up. And this. Hmm. Swipe. See. Snipe. Interesting. Was in story. Swipe C snipe. Don't know if I should change my current one. So we'll leave that. So yeah, let's start with the store. And I'm doing this on Vanguard instead of the Warzone um, application, so that we can actually get to see some of these things. So this is the battle pass. One thousand cod points, as every season. Um, so that's that now big rule bundle you basically get a mallet now one thing that disappoints me with this game is the attack on titan limited limited time only bundle has ended and i didn't get to purchase it when i wanted to because they never gave a time as to when it will end and i wanted to get the the melee weapon to do a melee cast hopefully fingers crossed that comes back but anyway here's a skin for wade looks pretty good 
I believe he's got the Punisher skin as well as well. So he's got a good set of skins. Um This is quite a decent decent kettle. Um Ruthless Precision. 1400 Decently priced. If I was a Wade player that uses Wade a lot, I would purchase that. That's a decent skin. Um, we're just trying to see the new stuff. Blown Bone Splitter. Splinter. So this is for Padma Vita. This is quite different compared to her other ones. So this will be something worth getting. Really worth getting now that I'm seeing this. A Gorenko Blueprint. Now this is interesting. Because I really like that gun. I think that gun is what the Barrett 50 cal should be. Especially from the Modern Warfare Barrett 50 cal, which is trash. This one is as close to Modern Warfare 2's Barrett 50 cal. Um, so that's pretty interesting. Let's see the execution. It's a bit slow, but it's not too bad. It's not too bad. So yeah, that's Bone Splinter. Anything else? Subbed, not dubbed. Okay. Nothing special. Red Wrap. Oh, this is for the Car 98, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I don't like it. Doesn't really look like it's got any finesse. But you do get a melee weapon with this bundle. But for just over a thousand, I don't think it's worth it. Um, full defense. And this is for Solange. This is a nice skin. That is a nice skin. Uh, I think that's oh, everything. I think that is everything. Is there anything new here? No. So yeah, that's everything. So let's get to the meat and potatoes. So Chingon, new operator, you get in for free. I wish it it would have been um, Florence Cartier or the other operator Jing Tao something or Ming Tao something like that okay I'm pretty uh, I'm guessing he's Italian because of the flag on his shoulder this is a nice it's a nice this is a nice skin nice operator so no complaints there okay and he gets there's two skins for him actually Matteo 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 okay couple skins um mountain knight for Daniel okay it's a fair skin but this thus far nothing that's wants me to get this bundle I mean this battle pass shotgun Charlie meh nothing special couple of calling cards again nothing special <laughs> F that's quite a funny charm uh, assault rifle blueprint Mm. Nothing special about it, but pretty boring. Okay, and this is the first um, execution. Yeah, or is this a highlight? Oh, it's a highlight, in fact. Uh, it's better than the other highlights that I've seen. 
So I will say that. Oh, I like this calling card. This is a nice calling card. So at least there's that. Constanez and Wade have. I'm pretty sure they have the most skins. I, I'm. I'm. I'm almost certain about it. This is a nice skin. This is a nice, nice skin though. So, I've seen two nice things thus far. Uh, let's keep going. And this is one of the new weapons, a marksman rifle, that apparently is qu quite strong. I'm gonna give it a go, but marksman rifles in this climate is not worth using whatsoever so we'll just give it a go just to give it a go okay transmit a handgun not super keen on the look there's a lot happening with it it might be because of the scope but yeah i'm not I'm not liking that early sketch okay this is a nice calling card this is a nice calling card and once again Wade get it gets another skin he like I said he he and Constantine's has the most skins Padma Vita might have a lot as well but definitely Wade and Constantine's uh, nothing's too special with that skin either oh this shotgun looks quite interesting I might have to um, start working on the shotgun because they nerfed the one that I liked before, which was a lot like the Spaz 12 from Modern Warfare 2 and 3. Okay, here's a highlight reel. Oh, that is sick. That might have to be. That might have to be one of the best new. That might have to be one of the best highlight reels I've seen, actually. Let's see it again. Yeah, this is the best highlight reel I've seen. So, I've seen three items and we're at level 26. That's actually making this battle pass worth it. But it's not a must buy thus far Roostick blueprint it's pretty boring the theme of the blueprints in this battle pass seem to be khaki green by the looks of things okay that's a nice reticule but there's a reticule like it similar like to it already that we have um what did I just see? So, just like I said earlier on, Wade and Constanese have the most skins, maybe Padma Vita, and this just adds to that theory, because here is another Padma Vita skin. So she got a new skin in a bundle, just like Wade did, and also a new skin in the Battle Pass. It's pretty cool. The skin is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I wonder if there's um I was wondering if there's more to this skin though. Like different colours to the same skin. That would be interesting. Nikita Avit. So this is another new weapon. Looks like an assault rifle. Yeah it is. Something tells me this is going to be really fire. I like the detail on it. Okay, I can't wait to try that out. Let's see this. Okay, that's a fire calling card. That is really good. <laughs> so, I'm, I've noticed four things I like. Uh, solarium watch. Okay, it's different. It's different, I'll say that, but meh. 
Ähm, okay. Regimental. Nö. Marksman Rifle Blueprint. Pretty boring, honestly. And again, the Marksman Rifles are not the way to go in this game. Um, core reaction. Rusted Glow. I wonder if this got trace arounds. But it's a light machine gun. People hardly use them. Especially me. Forest Essence. Let's take a look. Shigri Nora skin as well. And I, I mean, if this is your operator, I would definitely like this. This is a great skin. I like the image here as well. It looks quite cool. Okay. Another blueprint for a assault rifle i'm not seeing too many for snipers in fact i don't think i've seen one looks almost like a uh gun from the zombies so that's that's okay that's okay factory settings i like that i like that <laughs> this is quite cool um another blueprint Polyvinyl. Nothing special. Deciphered. Okay. Emblem. Right. Polina skin. Let's see what this is saying. Because the fur on the Shigniora skin looked quite decent. So. They're obviously using the same kind of technique to do the fur here, but this is a different type of animal fur. This is pretty cool. I think it... This reminds me of the skin that she wore in the cinematic for the story mode, actually. Or for her personal trailer. If I'm right about that, I'll add it to this video. Um... So on YouTube, you'll see what I mean. But yeah, this is pretty cool. If it is the same one, I'm thinking she didn't have the face mask or the or the hat. Right, another blueprint for an assault rifle. It looks pretty trashed, honestly. Okay, that charm is pretty boring. Is this? Okay, another blueprint for an assault rifle. At first, I thought it might have been the sniper Gorinko because of that stock and handle, but no, it's for the assault rifle. Um, if it was more metallic, met metallic looking, this would have been quite cool, but it's not got that sheen to it. Hmm nothing special okay submachine gun blueprint okay this will be good to have this is for the mp4 mp40 i don't have, i don't think i've got any besides final girl I, I don't think i use any other blueprint for the mp40 and i'm close to getting it gold so this in gold might be really nice so that's that's pretty good that's pretty good Okay, Roland skin. Okay, this is nice. They seem to have the skins for the operators this season all seem to be trench coats or long coats of some kind. Maybe that's the theme or part of the theme. But this is a nice skin. Again, if you mainly use Roland as your operator, I would definitely be happy with this. So there's that. Army grade watch nice and simpli simplistic nothing special though nothing special um blueprint for light machine gun so so far i haven't seen any for snipers that's nothing special either 
Uh, Solange skin. This is pretty detailed. I don't really like the goggles, but this is a very nice skin. I like the um, Ballon Delier. That looks fire. Um, but the operator I use currently is um, Halima. But I'll, my new operators looks like it's going to be the two new operators for this season. Whenever they get released. So, in a sense, I'm either using my COD points to buy this battle pass. Or, I'm going to use it to get the uh, Florence Carter. I think most likely I'm going to get her. More so than the other chick. But... We'll see because thus far this season it's a decent season in terms of the battle pass, but it's not enough for me to purchase it. I ain't seen nothing that's standing out that's making me wanna buy it. Um the Gorenko sniper gets a blueprint, finally. This is the first sniper blueprint in this whole battle pass. Lost blood. Uh, it's not very fancy, but I guess if you put on the gold or the rose gold camo skin over this blueprint, it might be really fire. It might be nice. That'll be something worth testing out, but I mean, level 71 to get to this, I would not be that excited about getting all that leveling up just for this and um, what is this M VP highlight Let's check it out. okay that's pretty cool nice and quick it's not too long or any anything like that okay submachine gun blueprint mm, nothing special Okay, decent calling cards, but it's not going to make me want to buy the battle pass for it. Uh, Lucas skin. It's alright. It's, it's, it's alright. I wouldn't be too disappointed if I was someone that uses uses um, Lucas. Uh, Photon Phantom pistol blueprint nothing crazy again i think with these pistols when they have these kind of scopes on them they just look so bulky and i don't know experimental looking iso nuclear blueprint for assault rifle okay this looks nice this actually looks good this looks real good i want to see um the barrel I really want to see how that looks. It looks like it's got like gold on the barrel. Is it gonna get to the barrel? I don't think it. It is. But it looks. It looks okay. This looks okay. Okay, classified. Okay, melee. Because because we're going to get Godzilla Ran King Kong later this season, 11th of May, I think a lot of people are thinking of shooting it down, right? Do you know what I'm thinking of? I'm thinking of meleeing it. Who knows? That might do incredible damage. I don't know. But we shall see. Uh, Beatrice skin. Okay, it's not a long coat. But this this is probably, out of all the skins this season, for the operators, this is probably the best looking skin. You can see the level of details from the fur 
that they're using to the texture on the actual jacket that's almost like a cardigan and then there's there's a waistcoat and a belt to bring it all together with a gun holster and knife holster yeah this is probably the best skin of this season three this far uh i would have loved for um halima to have this this would be brilliant um but it's for beatrice uh, i'll probably give that a try see how that looks in game um more calling cards oh copper breath at first i thought this watch might look really good but looking at it here it's pretty bland from this image thumbnail looks really fire though okay another highlight okay that's pretty cool again not too long or anything like that Okay, Marksman Rifle Blueprint. Doesn't look too bad. It's got like a... It's got like a sheen, a shine to it. To that blue. So that's that's not too bad. But again, no one really uses at all the Marksman Rifles. Um. Okay, this, is, this calling card must tie into the other calling cards that we've seen. So that's pretty nice actually that they all match up okay so legendary daniel skin so this is for the daniel operator who's a part of halima's click all right this is hard this is hard this is basically a ninja looking skin so this is hard so this skin and that Beatrice skin are fire. So this is, uh, getting to level 100, I would feel like I've achieved something. This was a good reward to get to level 100. This is good. This is a good skin. And another blueprint for an assault rifle. It's pretty bright. Nothing too special. And that is it. And the charm. Charm's okay, but it's a charm at the end of the day. But yeah, that's it. That is it. Um, there wasn't enough here for me to purchase it. Which... Um, there's been... There hasn't been too many battle passes that I haven't been on purchasing. I'm a bit surprised that this battle pass didn't have enough in it for me to purchase it. However, if you play Vanguard, this is probably a must. If you play Vanguard and one of your operators has a skin you should definitely get this because all the skins are pretty good the beatrice skin wade skin roland skin definitely daniel in fact daniel's got two skins he's got this one and and this is at the start and he's got this one at the end so if you if you use daniel you should definitely this is your season there's too many there's two great skins for Daniel so that's a must and Constanese has a great skin Lucas has a good skin Padma Vita's skin isn't that great Shignorora has a great skin Polina has a great skin that's it so yeah um out of five I'll give this season Uh, a free it's a free I'm not gonna purchase it for me personally I'd give it a two but to be in 
objective and unbiased, I'll give it a three. There's nothing other than skins. The blueprints for the weapons aren't that special. There's only one blueprint for a sniper, and that's the Gorinko sniper. Actually, is there one for the Car 98? I feel like there might have been. Let's just check. I don't think there was. It might have been a bundle that I saw it. This definitely isn't it. Yeah, I think it was a bundle that I saw the Car 98. Yeah, it was a bundle. Solange has a skin as well. So yeah, it's yeah, it's it's not all that. But if you play Vanguard and one of your operators has a skin here, you should definitely purchase it. If you use the Daniel skin, you should most definitely purchase it. And yeah, it looks like for the first I think this is the first season I'm actually going to use my COD points, not getting the battle pass and just getting the operator. I'm going to purchase uh, Florence Carter operator instead of the battle pass. And I'll do a video on her um, when that drops, as well as the other operator that drops this season as well. And we will also be playing through the season regardless anyway. Multiplayer and Warzone, try to get some more wins. Definitely get a win during season three as well. And await the Godzilla and King Kong epicness and how that's gonna be. I only wish that they did those kind of big type of battles and stuff, however they're gonna do it, in zombies. Those kind of big, you know, enemies would be so sick for zombies i feel like they've done that before in in zombies probably black ops three or two i can't remember but yeah that's the end of the video like comment and share your thoughts on season three and if you're looking forward to the epic battle between Godzilla and King Kong. If you've bought the Snoop Dogg skin, I don't think the Snoop Dogg skin's all that. I don't even know why he's in the game. That's just a waste of time, effort, and resources, in my opinion. But if you're a fan of Snoop Dogg, then you'd probably be gassed. Because if it was Drake, for instance, then I'd be gassed. But anyway, um, that's basically my review of Season 3. Wars Zone battle pass i'll catch you